Are you a passionate motorist wanting superior performance of your car or bike with more miles of extra ride and better upkeep of the engine? It's time to upgrade your fuel. Indian Oil's Extra Premium Petrol, the largest selling branded petrol in India, has been transformed into an exclusive premium fuel with higher octane rating and enhanced properties called XP95. After the successful launch of Indian Oil XP100 Petrol, the highest octane rating fuel in the country, Indian Oil has developed XP95 with 95 octane rating. XP95 offers an edge over other premium fuel brands in the industry with more power. We, Shrutilaya, are the classical art forms club of Bits Pilani KK Birla Goa campus. We gather here today in the loving memory of our founder, late Professor Suresh Ramaswamy, a connoisseur of the art forms himself who envisioned a rich tradition of the classical arts in this esteemed institution. As a club, we have taken the onus upon us to introduce and propagate the beauty of these ever-evolving art forms in our community and beyond. In an attempt to spread the beauty and complexity of these classical art forms that are so dear to us, we present to you the 10th edition of Sur Sangam. This year, we are fortunate to be able to host the first offline edition of Sur Sangam after the pandemic. In the past, we have had the pleasure of hosting several renowned classical artists at Sur Sangam, Pandit Praveen Godkhindi, Shri Uday Kumar Shetty, Yadnesh Raikar, Jyoti Hegde, and Shri D.V. Mohana Krishna, to name a few. To start off the event on an auspicious note, I would like to invite uh, the director of Bits Pilani KK Billa Goa campus, Professor Suman Kundu, and our faculty in charges, Professor Radhika Watson and Dr. Sundari Ramji to light the lamp. I request Ms. Sharvari Kulkarni to escort them to the stage. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am, for doing the honors. I now call upon our faculty in charge and BITS alumna, Dr. Sundari Ramji, to open the event. She is currently a faculty in the chemical engineering department of our college. Ma'am, please take the stage. A very good evening to everyone present here. Namaskaram and namaste to all the Rasikas present this evening. 
Uh, I am very happy to present the invocation song, uh, a composition by uh, Sri Narayana Tirthar in Ragamalika. I would like to dedicate this song to my son who is celebrating his 8th birthday today. In addition to that, there are a couple of uh, my dear ones who are celebrating their birthdays today. Vikram from Shrutilaya group, uh, Gautam Khare from Shrutilaya, uh, Sharvari from Shrutilaya and Janani Aunty. Lakshmi, Palavara, Deepa, Gopala. 
for that enchanting piece. Now we will have a small audio visual presentation by BITS alumnus Balakrishnan Raghavan, a proficient Carnatic vocalist where he has very kindly recorded a few words in the memory of Professor Suresh Ramaswamy. Hello, good evening, namaskaram, namaskar, namaste, adab to everyone who's gathered here tonight for the 10th edition of the Sursangam Festival, which we started in 2012 in memory of one of our dearest teachers, dearest Professor Suresh Ramaswamy, sir. My name is Balakrishnan Raghavan. I'm a musician and currently pursuing my PhD in musicology at the University of California, Santa Cruz. I was at Bits from 2008 to 2012 uh, doing computer science, uh, 2008, 87 PS, 111G. Suresh Ramaswamy sir, or Suresh sir, or Sura sir, as we called him, was one of the most influential teachers in my time at Pitts. A new student who comes in would need a welcoming, warm space. And for me, Radhika ma'am, him, we're just that for a lot of us actually it was like family it was like extended family for me and uh, my first encounter was with him was in the physics class he was teaching gyroscopes with the cycle tire and explaining us all we were so excited about the workings of the gyroscope and uh, he was one person students could just go to with any problem they had and uh, he would make time for you that was so special for all of us you could always find him in on campus riding his bicycle with a jhula jhula bai uh, and such an epitome of simplicity i remember once uh, when i was uh, when we were all prepping up for a concert and there was no time and i was running around and i had gone to his place to uh, get some signatures and stuff. And then uh, he realized uh, I hadn't eaten. It was evening and he realized I hadn't eaten anything. And by then he was, I, I think he was a dean. And he was such a person. And he made me dosas, like one of the best crispy dosas he made us. I mean, he's just, he was just magical. He was unreal as a person. And also he was so supportive of any art related things he was such a champion of the arts whenever we needed uh, permission for spaces funding requests he would just be such a champion and he would always encourage us all of us to do more and more and in so many of our numerous dinners he would host uh, we would be at his place very often and he would speak about his college life for example he would speak about uh, once how uh, his ragging experience at, uh, at Bits Bilani many years ago and what we should do as students and he would also be such a good listener asking us what we liked what we wanted to do in life uh, after we passed out and he was someone everyone loved liked and everyone trusted everyone could go to him for example even when he was part of disco uh, the disciplinary committee which generally students are quite afraid of we were all so sure that he would not let anything bad happen to us and he was one person who would speak for the students who would speak for us so and uh, for any concerts related thing any arts related thing he was always there just saying i'm here do what you all can and encouraging us pushing us uh, to do more and more and all of that i i remember before the last time i had met him he him and radhika ma'am before i passed out of college he had gifted me this beautiful book of Vivekananda with his signature and uh, I really cherish that moment and cherish all the times we've had with him. And he was such a jovial person, always cracking jokes, making the mood light, even in the most stressful of situations and uh, a very, very 
very very rare person very rare teacher and so much of my life thanks to him so much of my life thanks to him and radhika ma'am what i am today what i have uh, grown up to be is all thanks to them i couldn't be where i am today without uh, without them and uh, yes thanks a lot uh, to the working committee uh, for organizing uh, this year after year the working committees that have come after us of shruti laya to radhika ma'am to sundari and to the performers of today sukrit and his team and ramakrishna murthy and his team i wish you i wish all of you the very best and thanks a lot thanks thanks and uh, thank you i request sundari ma'am to welcome the director on behalf of shruti laya I request the director to come on stage. I would like to request the director of Fitzpilani KK Bella Goa campus Professor Suman Kondo to address the gathering. very good afternoon a very good evening to you all uh, i am privileged to be part of the 10th edition of the annual music festival sur sangam 2022 organized by sutilaya i learned about sutilaya very recently you know as you all know i am here only for the last 6 months and i take this opportunity to thank sutilaya specially for organizing this event and for carrying forward the lamp of classical music you know and keeping it alive and kicking you know and bringing to us moments of joy unbridled pleasure pure entertainment and a sense of belonging you know because it's an age old, age old tradition classical music that needs to be entertained in itself and kept alive and i'm very happy to see a large number of young students who are present here on behalf of sutilaya and bits pilani kk belagwa campus i welcome you all to the event thank you for being here on a sunday evening that shows how much you love the music here on behalf of all of you sutilaya and bits pilani kk billagua campus i welcome the musicians for today evening especially our chief guest you know the supremely talented shri ramakrishna and murthy thank you for being with us you know taking time out of your busy schedule to be with us and enlighten us with your music and uh, i would also like to thank um, of course uh, dr radhika for being with us uh, i have learned about professor Suresh Ramaswamy from the video right now and of course by asking a few students and uh, I'm happy that we still remember him and in his fond memory that we continue this annual fest you know and it should go on 
my full support will be with Shrutilaya at all times. That's a promise as long as I'm here. Thanks to the other musicians of today evening. You know, good music without good accompaniment means nothing. And I'd also welcome Mr. Bharadwaj and Mr. Vittal Rangan for being with us here tonight as well. And probably we also have alumni performance uh, by Sukrut, Sukrut Tamaskar, he's here. Uh, welcome, uh, welcome you as well and your accompaniments, Amai and Aniket as well. And of course, our very own Sundari. This is the second time I've heard her in enchanting invocation. And as also thanks for being faculty in charge for Sukrit, uh, for Sruti Laya, which is, which is very important. And I don't know whether Dr. Rashmi is here. She's part of every community event, thanks to her as well. Thanks to the entire team of Sruti Laya. I have met only a couple of you, I haven't met others. I don't remember your name. But I know from the email that S. Niharika is the coordinator of, coordinator of uh, Sutilaya. So thanks, Niharika, and your entire team. Thank you. And this is a very important event in my mind because we are delving into science, engineering, and technology day in and day out. But without music, nothing means anything, right? In a way, you know, uh, our existence of the universe, and finally, as humans, all started with music, is what we believe, what we know, the Big Bang. And Om aptly represents that beginning, right? As you know, when you hear something good, we say it's music to the ears, right? So it shows what music means to us, you know? There are various ways we word the, use the word music in our life. We say music of life, right? And anyone who has a taste of music of life leads a very pleasing life, right? Give any mood in our lives, whether we are sad, whether we are happy, okay, it's music that will either uplift us or keep us happy. So it is very important in the Science and Technology Institute to keep music alive. And I'm happy that Shrutila is doing this for us. And I hope you can do this more often, you know, as time would allow us, you know, maybe twice a year, I don't know if it's possible at all. I know organizing such events is not easy, but we need more of that, you know. And science and engineering is not without music. You know, the effect of music on our brain is studied over and over again, you know. There are several brain images that are captured when you hear a music. So it's, it's, it, it, it keeps us alive, you know. Science is music to us, and in music there's a lot of science, okay. So I welcome you all again, and I hope you'll enjoy this musical extravaganza tonight, today evening. Thank you all, thank you. Thank you for your kind words, sir. Uh, I now welcome Professor Radhika Watson to join the director on the stage to welcome the artists. This year, we have the great honor of hosting the stalwart Carnatic vocalist, Sri Ramakrishnan Murthy. I request Sri Ramakrishnan Murthy to come on the stage, and I request Professor Suman Kondo to welcome him.
Thank you, sir. Today, Shri Ramakrishnan Murthy will be accompanied by Shri N.C. Bharadwaj on Mridamgam and Shri Vittala Rangan on the violin. I request Professor Radhika Watson to welcome Shri N.C. Bharadwaj. Uh, I request Pro Professor Radhika Watson to welcome Shri Vettala Rangan on the stage. Thank you, sir. Today, we are also very happy to host our alumna, Shri Sukrut Tamhankar. I request Professor Suman Kundu to welcome him. Thank you, sir. He will be accompanied by Shri Amaya Patwardhan on the tabla and Shri Aniket Toraskar on the harmonium. I request Shri Amaya Patwardhan and Shri Aniket Toraskar to come on the stage. Thank you, sir. Huh? Huh? What? Whose name? I request Shri Amaya Bhattwar to, to come on the stage. I now hand over the dais to Megha and Aryan. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Guru Gobind Do Khade, Kake Lagu Pai, Balihari Guru Aapne Govind Dio Batai. Saint Kabir Das has rightly said, Guru, who shows us the path to God, is above the Almighty. I am Aryan Agarwal. And I am Megha Mahadevan. We have been fortunate to have a set of wonderful teachers who have been helping us throughout the year to increase our knowledge of classical arts. On this occasion, we would be extremely humbled to pay honor to our gurus. I would request Director Bitspilani KK Birla Goa Campus, Professor Suman Kundu, to hand over the mementos to our teachers as a token of our respect and gratitude towards them. First, I would like to invite Dr. Radhika Watson, co-founder and faculty in charge of our club, to receive the memento. Ma'am is a professor in the Department of Physics. Her continuous support and guidance has helped us reach great heights and establish a well-known identity across the campus as a club. She is also an excellent Veena player. I 
I would now like to invite Mrs. Hema Meenakshi Sundaram to receive the memento. Ma'am has been teaching the Introduction to Carnatic Music course for many years under the Humanities Department of our college. She has also conducted a lecture demonstration during the COVID pandemic for our club. She has been a constant support for the conduction of our events. Next, I would like to call upon Mrs. Sandhya Jayakumar. Ma'am has conducted Carnatic audit courses for our club and has been a constant support in conduction of events. She has been teaching the introduction to Carnatic music course under the humanities department of our college. Next, I would like to call upon Dr. Sundari Ramji, our faculty in charge and also a BITS Goa alumna. She has seen the club from both perspective as a member as well as the faculty in charge now. Her great understanding of both sides of the club makes the decision-making procedures very smooth for us. She is a talented Carnatic vocalist as we all witnessed already. Finally, I would like to call upon Ms. Sharvari Kulkarni, a PhD student in the physics department and a classical enthusiast. She has been deeply involved in the working of the club and has acted as our crisis manager from time to time. Her great sense of event logistics management has helped us sail through the last three Sursangam editions with great success. She also is a harmonium player. Thank you, sir. We are extremely glad to have you here at the event. Now, I hand over the dais to Amritanshu and Shamita. Now, I would like to call upon one of our prestigious alumni, Sukrut Tamhankar. He did his ME in Embedded Systems from BITS Goa and is currently working with MathWorks company. In addition to this, Sukrut has undergone Hindustani classical music training under the late Pandit Arvind Bua Patwardhan of Sangli for seven years. He has been undergoing training under Pandit Hrishikesh Bodhis of Miraj for the past eight years. He is also an All India Radio graded artist in Abhang category. Sukrut has performed a role of Parashar Rishi in Sangeet Natak, Matsya Gandha and in the shows of Marathi Geet Ramayan. He recently played a role of Sri Krishna in a Sangeet Natak, Sobhadra, presented by Swaraj Chota Gandharva Pratishtan. He has done shows in Pune. Kolhapur, Nasik, and Sangli. The upcoming shows are on 16th October in Pune and 24th October in Indore. He also got a chance to sing an abhang, Hari Alare, for music do director Dr. Salil Kulkarni in his Abhijat series. Accompanying, accompanying him on the tabla, we have Ame Patwardhan, who is a disciple of Pandit Ramdas Palsule, and on the harmonium, we have Aniket Toraskar, who is a disciple of Sri Raya Kargonkar and is currently working as a music teacher at Ravindra Bhavan Vasco. Let's lend our ears to the amazing performance.
everyone. First of all, I would like to thank all the Shrutilaya members and the organizing committee for inviting me here for the, this year's Surya Sangam. It feels great to be back on the campus and perform here in the auditorium. I'll start my recital with Rag Yaman, Madhulai Zhaptal, followed by Bandish in Tintal, and then followed by one Abhanga. Thank you.
Thank you, our dearest alumni, for such a soulful piece. As a token of our appreciation, we would like to call upon Sundar Imam to present them with mementos. After such an enthralling performance by our alumni, we will now move on to the next highlight of the evening. It is a great pleasure for us to host Sri Ramakrishnan Murthy. 
Ramakrishnan Murthy is hailed as one of the most talented Carnatic vocalists of his generation. He is known for his unswerving loyalty to tradition, wise sense of aesthetics, and sincerity in presentation. His versatility, rich repertoire, and creativity have been much appreciated by the audience and critics alike. After his graduation from the University of California, he moved to Chennai in 2011 to pursue Carnatic music more intensely. In Chennai, he began to learn from R.K. Sriram Kumar, under whose tutelage Ramakrishnan blossomed as a musician and also as a performing artist. Ramakrishnan is an A-grade artist in All India Radio and Doordarshan and a regular performer in the music circuit in Chennai and across India. He has also performed widely in several international festivals in North America, the United Kingdom, Singapore, Australia, New Zealand, and the Middle East. He has had the rare privilege of having shared the stage with many stalwarts, including his gurus and other renowned musicians. He was awarded the Outstanding Vocalist for four consecutive years from the Madras Music Award, the Best Senior Vocalist in 2016, the Senior Outstanding Concert Award in 2017, and the Senior Outstanding Vocalist Award in 2019. Accompanying him, we also have Mr. Vittal Rangan on the violin. Having performed over 2,000 concerts in a career spanning across more than a decade, Vittal Rangan is an A-grade violinist of the All India Radio and Doordarshan. He has also been fortunate enough to have accomplished four generations of musicians, being one of the much desired violinists, both as an accompanist and a solo performer, he was bestowed with a unique opportunity to perform at the iconic Gateway of India for a Jugalbandi concert featuring Smriti, uh, Srimati Ranjani Gayatri and Srimati Kaushiki Chakrabarti. Having an extra ear for other genres of music, Mr. Vittal Rangan also explores multiple avenues to aesthetically integrate Carnatic music into the same. On the Mridangam, we have Mr. N.C. Bharadwaj. He has won awards in famous organizations like the Music Ac Academy, Narada Gana, Gana Sabha, and Sri Tyaga Brahma Gana Sabha. His playing is characterized by precision of strokes, giving rise to clarity, balance between the valantalai, toppi, and melody. He is a prolific rhythm maestro, swimming in the sea of beats since a tender age. He has learned under Vidwan Sri Vanchiyan Gopalan since the age of six. He has also learned under Nanganallu Sri Ram, who is a disciple of Vidwan Kairi Kudimani. Today, are you a passionate motorist wanting superior performance of your car or bike with more miles of extra ride and better upkeep of the engine? It's time to upgrade your fuel. Indian Oil's Extra Premium Petrol, the largest selling branded petrol in India, has been transformed into an exclusive premium fuel with higher octane rating and enhanced properties called XP95. After the successful launch of Indian Oil XP100 Petrol, the highest octane rating fuel in the country, Indian Oil has developed XP95 with 95 octane rating.
to everybody and a very warm welcome to all of you thank you so much for being here at the outset i would like to offer my congratulations to the sur sangam committee and the advisory board uh, respected director sir and uh, sundari ma'am and other professors and other faculty what a wonderful uh, event you have put together it is truly i speak on behalf of all three of us and when i say it's absolutely our pleasure to be here so thank you so much for having us um we will begin today's concert with composition of shri muttu swami dikshitar it's in raga gaula set to mishra chapu taala cycle of seven beats
ni ba ma ba ba ma ga ma ri ga ma ri ri sa ni si ma sa ni ni ba ma ba ni ma ni ba ma ba ba ma ga ma ri ri sa ni pa ri sa si ma sa sa ni pa ri ri sa ni ba ma ba ba ri sa ri ri sa ni ba sa ni ma ba ri ba ma ga ma ri ri sa ni pa si ma sa
ಗಣಪತಿ
ಮರಿಗಲದ ಅಂಬ ನಿಂಗಿನ ಮರಿಗಲದ ಗದಿಲೋ ಗಮುಲೋ ನಿಂಗಿನ ಮರಿಗಲದ ಗದಿಲೋ ಗಮುಲೋ ನಿಂಗಿನ ಮರಿಗಲದ ಗದಿಲೋ ಗಮುಲೋ ನಿಂಗಿನ ಮರಿಗಲದ ಭವಾನಿ ಗಮ್ಮ 
Shyama Shastri's composition, Raga Riti Gaula, set to Aditala Tishranade. I'm 
स्वाति त्रिनाल कांपोजिशन रागा कुंतल वराली सेट्टू खंडा चापू तालम
in raga kapi we present shri tyagaraja's composition chetu aditala
that was composition of Gopalakshana Bharati in Raga Joan Puri. Ah! 
That performance was the definition of mesmerizing. We are indeed honored to have witnessed it. Thank you so much, sir. I would now like to call our beloved Radhika Vatsal ma'am on the stage to present our artists with a token of our gratitude.
Good evening, everyone. It has been such an honor to have been a part of the organizing committee of this respected event hosted by Shruti Laya. On behalf of Shruti Laya, I, the coordinator, would like to extend my heartiest gratitude to Sri Ramakrishna Murthy, Sri Vithal Rangan, and Sri N.C. Bharadwaj for their extremely mesmerizing performance today. It's a matter of great prestige for Shruti Laya and Vitspilani KK Birla Goa campus to have had the opportunity to host you and enjoy your concert live. Thank you. Special thanks to our co-presenters, Indian Oil XP95, as part of the Indian Oil Now Here Us series. I would also like to thank First Edition Arts for facilitating this collaboration. Thank you for all the support and help. <laughs> Sukrit Paya, we cannot express in words how grateful the club is to have witnessed your ever-evolving art once again this Sursangam 2022. Your art, especially as an alumnus of BITS Goa, is a huge inspiration to everyone here at Shruti Laya. Thank you, Sukrut Tawankar, <laughs> Amay Patwardhan, and Aniket Toraskar for your extremely beautiful renditions today. Shiv Sundar, Darshna, and Gautam, it's not an easy feat playing ta the Tanpura for over two hours. Hats off for pulling this off. Uh, I would also like to thank the Department of Photography, the Department of Backstage for all your efforts. This event wouldn't have been possible without you. I also thank the AV unit, the AC unit, PR office, VGH, the estate manager, and chief security officer for all your cooperation. Thank you, Professor Suman Kundu, director of WITS Goa, for providing us the opportunity to host this event. Uh, to all my fellow Shrutilaya members and our strong faculty team, it's amazing where this love for classical arts has got us, even to such a level that we have the honor of hosting such reputed artists from all over India. Thank you for your passion and your motivation to preserve and tre treasure our traditional art forms. Shrutilaya's very essence lies in each and every one of you. Last but not the least, Shrutilaya expresses its utmost gratitude to the audience your enthusiasm for the classical arts is a very vital part of what keeps us motivated and passionate. In conclusion, thank you one and all for making this event a huge success. With this, it's a wrap on Sursangam 2022. See you all next year. Thank you. Are you a passionate motorist wanting superior performance of your car or bike with more miles of extra ride and better upkeep of the engine? It's time to upgrade your fuel. Indian Oil's Extra Premium Petrol, the largest selling branded petrol in India, has been transformed into an exclusive premium fuel with higher octane rating and enhanced properties called XP95. After the successful launch of Indian Oil XP100 Petrol, the highest octane rating fuel in the country, Indian Oil has developed XP95 with 95 octane rating. XP95 offers an edge over other premium fuel brands in the industry with more power, more speed and more miles. The higher the octane rating, lower is the knocking tendency of fuel, thereby increasing the thermal efficiency of the engine with more fuel efficiency. XP95 keeps your engine clean and prevents any deposits in the combustion chamber, thus keeping your engine like new always. XP95 gives better anti-knock properties, resulting in faster acceleration, smoother drive, increased mileage and reduced emission while guaranteeing longer life of the engine. A product of Indian Oil's intense R&D efforts, XP95 has special properties that enhances the performance of not only new generation vehicles but also rejuvenate old vehicles to perform better. Moreover, XP95 protects the engine from corrosion drastically reduces carbon monoxide emissions by 44% and improves fuel economy by up to 3.95% while increasing the power of the engine with 20% faster acceleration. Now, think of high octane performance at a minimal price difference because with XP95, nothing can stop you from your passion for driving with high performance of your car and bike. 
upgrade to XP95 to unlock and unleash the passion of driving. XP95 from Indian Oil.